what up YouTube it's rain the mask now this is just a, a video uh, uh, it's probably a rant video so I'm not sure how I'm gonna piece this together um, but I'm gonna give you a few examples and there's gonna be some different video clips uh, it might be a long video it might not be but the first point is so these obviously you know what these are um, and like yeah so you know what these are but then you know what it is you come to the back and then I'd ask you to tell me, is that authentic or is that replica? Um, let me try and get it from that side. So is that authentic or is that replica? Or am I being over picky? Um, now, what it is, I've seen replicas and the 23 has been quite good. But this is an authentic shoe. Um, you can probably tell by the carbon fibre. Um, but I just don't think that, I don't know. Maybe I'm just being overly picky overly picky now the next example is of the varsity not the varsity the infrareds there they came out recently um now i'm going to show you something and then you tell me what you think Now this is the ongoing saga. So these, as some of you may know, actually some of you don't know, these are the Varsity Sixes, not to be confused with what you've just seen, which are the infrared sixes. Now what I wanna pay, bring your attention to, pay your attention to, what kind of English is that? What I wanna bring your attention to is the paintwork. Now, let me just get that in that kind of quality. Now look at that, these are replicas, like, a fraction of the price that you pay, obviously for the um, infrared sixes, you paid what, 135, maybe that's $170. But these are like a fraction of the price, maybe 60 quid or maybe 70 quid. I'm not even sure how much I paid for these um, or how much they are sold for, sorry. But if you look at the quality, like you, you think, okay, well, yeah, there's, there's a few paint flaws, but for what I pay for them, I, I'll accept it. The leather is all good and stitching and all that. But compared to what I just showed you in the other video, are the authentics acceptable? Like, I would rather wear these knowing that they are a fraction of the price than wear the authentics that are £135, but the paintwork is shit. I, I, like, maybe I'm overreacting, and this is why I'm doing this video. You guys holler at me and you, and you tell me, am I overreacting in regards to the, you pay £135 and the quality is crap in regards to the <clears throat> leather and in regards to the actual paintwork. It's like buying a brand new car and then you buy a brand new car and you see brush strokes in the car, like on, on the paintwork. Like a man's just used a paintbrush rather than the proper spray canting. Like, would you accept it? No. So why would you accept it on these? Like, I know enough men are just on a hype thing and they don't know what to look for. So they just buy them and they're like, right, okay, yeah, that's me. I'm nice. Boom, skeng, I've got these, bye. Not me, man. I'd rather buy the reps. Um, let me know your thoughts anyway. Rain the Mask, signing out. See ya.